What up, YouTube? So, uh, it's a semi nice day. It's kind of, it's going to storm later on. So, got a little overcast, and I just want to get out here because it's so hot and see if I'm going to get this 62 sprocket on. So, we got the 62 sprocket. Uh, I'm pretty sure it should be easy because it's just these bolts right here. It's four of them. All right, around. I'm just going to spin the tire. I'm going to have to pop the chain, spin the tire. And uh, take it off. I know I'm gonna have to build some more chains. So I'm gonna have to add some links to the chain with the 62 sprocket because it's going up a size. And uh, that's probably gonna be the hardest part for me. So, uh, with that being said, let's get to it. All right, I'm gonna start by popping the chain, put it on some uh, floor jacks. I don't know how to start yeah. Pop the chain, we got the. Uh, that's the link right here. All right, I'm gonna pause it till I get the chain. Okay, as soon as I pause it, that's when the chain link come out. It's so crazy. So we take the master link out. Okay. With the master link off, you can go on and undo these bolts by the way. Okay, I think I'm gonna loosen this big box first. Find the right socket. All right, so I got a 10 millimeter wrench and half inch socket. Uh, uh, 10 millimeter socket and a half inch wrench. Take it off. Oh, yeah, I knew that was going to be hard. Pause it. So they are really on there. So I think I'm just gonna take this whole back top, then yeah, take it off. That way. Don't wanna do that though. Um, let me keep on trying a little bit longer. So I have to use a, a wrench. The wrench and a uh, um the thing to break them. Uh, I also had to put a zip tie on the brake, which is gonna do me no good right now. Well, I can break at least three.
Well, that was pretty hard, but that broke now, so I'm gonna take them off. Y'all just seen my method of how I break. All right, last one. Focus. One on top of the other. That's why you gotta add more chain. Sweating pretty bad. Forget this. I'm not gonna tighten this up until we figure out our chain length. Okay, because my hand don't fit too well back there, I gotta stick the uh, nut on the wrench like that. And hopefully, it stays on the side of the hand. Yeah. And then we 
keep on with the rest of them. Okay, got it on there. I don't know the torque spec, but for me, I did like two other duggers, and, uh, and hopefully that was enough. Look at that psych fella. Now, we gotta see how much chain I'm gonna need. To make this happen, I think I, I'm gonna let it all the way in. Bring the tie all the way in. Okay, look like we need about four links, I guess. With that mic, just so up in the air. It might be good enough. Oh, so this whole tank up channel. Chain, I get y'all back with me. Okay, I got my chain on there. It's a little slack on it right now, but I got it all the way to the front so I can add tension on it by uh, twisting these these little bad boys in. So I'm gonna add the go on add the master link back on. It took forever to add. I hate dealing with chains, but it took forever just to make this long chain. All I had to do was add five more links to whatever I had, and uh, so I went. I broke one of these again, so that'll be my second one I don't broke on here. Uh, I got pieces of chain everywhere, but it was, I, I'm hoping it's gonna be worth it by the time. I don't even know if this chain is structurally sound anymore. I don't broke it so many times, so. Uh, but with that being said, we're gonna continue to push on and uh, let's see what happens. All right, got everything mounted up. I think I'm happy with the chain tension. I'm probably gonna bring it back a little bit, but for now, I'm gonna leave it a little loose. Uh, we're gonna see. See what it do. Set y'all up outside on the stand. And uh, all I want to do is just see if I can pull my heel in my driveway. It took a while. It took a while. It shouldn't have been that hard, I thought. But uh, I guess let's check it out. All right, let's see if I can pull it. Okay, well, the 62 pulled the heel, and I had no problem with it. I think I, I like it, but it still ain't no torque converter. Um, the torque converter had you shooting up the heel. Also, I noticed that uh, with it, the looseness, is it's got a little rub right here, so I'm going to have to tighten my chain up a little bit more. But uh, other than that, I, it's okay. I think I live with it. Well... As always, thanks for watching. Have fun and stay safe.